Joseph Lungu, Zambian inventor of the safety and security system for motor vehicles, is thinking big. Joseph, who is proud to show off his design, wants his invention to go global. Hi, my name is Joseph Lungu, an innovator inventor from Zambia. I have invented the motor vehicle safety and security system, which I will be demonstrating to you later on. Well, first and foremost, I invented this system due to the fact that I observed that in Zambia and in Africa at large, most of the road accidents, road damages, even the vehicle lifespan reduced are mostly caused by unmonitored overload of vehicles. It is because of this that motivated me to design a system that will reduce unnecessary road accidents, road damages by switching off the engine of the car at the same time and letting the owner via video phone call, uh, text message, even a phone call. So I'm going to do the, 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 the demonstration for it. I'll start with uh, the engine. Okay, I've started the engine and I'll try to put more load. So I'm trying to put more load here. The moment it exceeds the, the maximum capacity, the engine will stop. Okay. Then at the same time, the owner will receive a phone call. Okay. So it's overloaded here. So even if you start the engine, so long as it's overloaded, it will not start until you maintain the weight. Okay. And at the same time, you should receive a phone call there. Okay. So that phone call entails that your vehicle is overloaded, and now you, the owner, you can take action. And on the actual system, it, it's going to be coupled with a video server and a digital server. So that when you are when it alerts the owner, the owner has access to see how much overload the vehicle has taken via on his personal mobile phone. There's also a security system. It's a safety and a security system. The sec security system, it's coupled with uh, there's, uh, this, uh, these are parking lights here. As you are coming out from the vehicle, use a key or a mobilizer to lock the doors. But in a case, maybe you're in, in the office and you have just remembered that you didn't lock the doors or the windows of the vehicle, you can just use your personal mobile phone. So I will, ju I will just make a phone call to this system so that you see I'm using this door handle but on the actual system it will be connected to the tires any any component that you'd want to protect so I'll make a phone call here to the system okay you can see the lights here flashing these are parking lights so meaning as it is now the the, the security system is activated at the same time it has locked, this is a mechanism for locking the doors of the vehicle, so now it has activated. In a case now an intruder comes to tamper with your vehicle, the moment you just tamper with the, the door handle of it. So the transmitter here is making a phone call to the owner to alert the owner that there is an intrusion on, on your vehicle. Okay, so I've just received the phone call. This phone call entails that there is tampering on, on my vehicle. And cutting the, the signal here, you can just use your personal mobile phone again. Okay. You can either use uh, the key or a mobilizer or your personal mobile phone to deactivate. So at this point, I can even try to, to open here. Nothing, it won't pick me as an intruder. It's a safety and security system. It's a project that I started from the scratch. Doing research, I'll get a, a component and another component, try to put them together to see if they will give me the, the outcome, the, the function that I want. And at the end of the day, it was able to give me the function that I had. So it's uh, something that it, uh, came from my mind. The things that I've been facing, I remember last time I almost cried, whereby I, I made the project and it was uh, it was fully done then everything just got banned and it took me two years creating the same project i almost cried but i was like hey, let me just start it afresh there's nothing i can do joseph who is proud to show off his design wants his invention to go global and this is why he has registered it with the patents and companies registration agency he also wants to work with all relevant organizations in his quest to grow his invention. I do these things from my room, but uh, I'm looking forward to a campaign. So far, I've 
have acquired a patent, a protection with PACRA uh, over the same product that I've made, the safety and the security system. PACRA patent examiner Chewe Chilufia is happy with Joseph's approach. If you have someone coming up with a solution like that, then we get comforted. We say Zambians are not just people who look at problems. They provide solutions. And young people like Joseph is one of them. So we applaud him and we greatly support such initiatives as Joseph has come up with. Joseph's invention has received support from international organizations like the United Nations. The World Intellectual Property Organization, WILCO, PACRA has established a technology and innovation support center, TISC, the function of the TISC is to offer advisory services to inventors, students, academicians and the general public on filing off and drafting of patent applications, searching patent databases, as well as provision of facilities for conducting state-of-the-art searches on various innovations and accessing free online scientific journals. The TISC is therefore one of our efforts to promote innovation and creativity and ensuring that our inventors are supported adequately. Let me mention that one of the beneficiaries of our awareness programs is the 22-year-old graduate of the North, Northern Technical College, NOTEC, Joseph Lung. Joseph invented a security system for vehicles which uses mobile and video communication to alert owners when their vehicles are tempered with as well as cut the engine system to stop the motor vehicle from starting the engine when loading capacity is exceeded. This is a local invention from a young Zambian, which if commercialized can help solve some of our traffic accidents which are as a result of overloading. We have engaged various institutions of higher learning as well as research institutions to ensure that products of their research that are capable of patent protection are duly patented. Students of higher learning institutions have been specifically... What a wonderful innovation. We now know that overloading by drivers around the world will surely come to an end because overloading may also tend to cause accidents on the road. If this project can be commercialized as he wishes, we do know that we will have safety on all road users.